Hi, I'm Nancy Marcus, and I have been challenged by Devin Reeves to take the 2014 Recovery Walks Challenge from ProAct, and um, I'm happy to take that on. I love a challenge. Thanks, Devin. Um, I would like to challenge Peter Gaumann from the White House, um, Holly Sherman from Recovery Grads and the Haven at College out in California, and also Carl Anticell. Uh, from Young People in Recovery and Minding Your Mind. So hopefully you guys will take on the challenge next and either tell your recovery story um, or what recovery means to you or donate to the ProAct Recovery Walks, which is happening on September 20th uh, in Penn's Landing in Philadelphia. We've seen it in Greg Williams, um, the anonymous people, and you know what? Come to think of it, I think I'm going to challenge him too. So Greg Williams, you're, you're challenged. So it's happening this September 20th, and um, I hope to see you all there. And I am going to both donate to the PROACT Challenge and also uh, tell a little bit about my story, um, what recovery means to me uh, as a person in long-term recovery, um, is that I have not had an alcoholic drink or mind-altering drug in over five years. My recovery has, well, that, see that open window? That's pretty much what it is. Um, when a door closes, a window opens. And my recovery has opened many windows and opportunities for me. Most importantly is um, wonderful interaction and relationship with my family. Um, my three boys, who I'm unbelievably proud of and my daughter Lee um, and I love them very much and my relationship and closeness with them is awesome that's number one is my family and uh, my friends and those that you know I have in my life now it's full of just love and blessings and I'm really grateful what my life is now from day to day um, in my personal life, in my career, is attributable to my being in recovery and the tribe of people around me that, um, you know, I just adore. Um, I laugh a ton. That's huge for me. Um, we're not a glum lot, right? And, um, yeah, I'm able to help others, uh, which is really um, super rewarding. And so every day I get to wake up and do something that is really meaningful to me um, and that helps others and frankly that um, is creating or helping to promote change that really needs to happen across the country. People in recovery have largely been stigmatized uh, and ignored, underserved and not supported the way that they should be by our systems. And so being a semi-revolutionary who was looking for uh, mobilization and change. So really glad to be a part of this movement, uh, which is a recovery movement. This is the army that's going to change what's going to happen for the next generation and um, really proud of what we're doing and to be a part of this. So thank you again, Devin. And um, yeah, Peter, Carl, Holly, and Greg, you're on. See you guys at the walk. Bye.